The Democratic Alliance visited the Walter Sisulu Square in Cape Town to assess the damage caused to it. The DA Gauteng spokesperson for sports, arts, culture and recreation, Waldry Peach, says the party is concerned about the economic loss for Soweto residents that has been caused by the vandalism of the square, as the square attracts tourists. Now, Peach says the plan is to escalate the matter to the city of Johannesburg Council for it to be resolved as soon as possible. Ikaela lezo politiko i Democratic Alliance lenze ushlolo e Walter Sisulu Square nezinze kwindawe ya se clip down. Iti e iti enza ulu kele lo kuba ikalabile ila sheko yezo koko shokuba shali base soweto. Emba kukuba kona kali swe indawe ya yo yembali i Walter Sisulu Square. Emba kukuwa mba mba kulandawe elipe la linike inkaze lo ye moya yo nelika za njingale yo. We came to Walter Susulu Square today to do an oversight of the current status uh, of the square and we were absolutely shocked what we found. Uh, the, the square has been completely vandalized, it has been completely destroyed. Uh, a lot of the existing structures uh, have been gutted, they've uh, removed a lot of the steel, copper cables, all the electricity has been vandalized uh, and this all stems from uh, the unrest in 2021. Lenda hao ye mbali apo no mkulu wenkulule ko uzinze kona uko nakali iswa kwa ayo kuyenze ukubayeshe umtala nenjengo baba kengiti. Benga saikele linjenga kukala. A lot of the artifacts have been removed uh, which is a, a great tragedy. Uh, we've also come to visit uh, the Soweto Hotel. Uh, which are struggling with uh, electricity connection problems. Uh, but they've also, you know, had a severe drop-off in, uh, in their uh, residency and uh, their occupancy. Elikela li tiliza kukritise la lomba kuipunga leste kwa saseko likuwa eliza kushela ukuba intoni na elinga yenza ukuputu la landao. Kuinda baze Soweto TV ndi ngunomza balazo mtuka Eclipse Town.